Okay, this is Lance at the My First Sense Warehouse, and for the next few minutes we're going to talk about all the bundle upgrades and explain why you'd want them or why you wouldn't want them. Uh, this is uh, this is at the top of the list normally, very popular. Uh, we call it the agitator. It could be uh, a mixer called a mixer pump. And this is how the agitator mounts inside the tank. It's got a mount plate, and we'll just show you how that mounts. It uh, comes in like that, rotates. When you install it though, you, you can't do it that way. You come in from the top of the tank, push this over the ears, and you're in business. You can also change the orientation based on the holes and, and things and the cable tie uh, that's, that's, uh, that's used. Anyway, the reason you'd want a, an agitator is in case you have uh, chemicals or particulates that are suspensions that fall out of, uh, out of solution and you want to you maintain homogeneity. So it's very popular with uh, food, uh, plant foods and uh, anything with uh, larger particles in suspension. For all agitator upgrades, uh, you'll end up with this silver control knob in this location in all cases, right, right below the, the strap hook. And the, the, the reason why that's nice is because you can reach back and adjust the flow rate if you're finding that your the particles are not being suspended correctly. Uh, the, the idea of on this variable power is to adjust it to the lowest setting uh, so that you maintain, so that you maintain the, the best efficiency from your battery. This particular model is shipping today and it was uh, the customer asked for an agitator pump plus a DeWalt. This is a generic DeWalt battery and we're just going to show how to install that. So here's, here's the standard control panel for, this is a battery upgrade and it's in, it's in place of the charger panel, the normal where the charger panel is normally located. And then this is the agitator uh, pump. And uh, we're going to turn it on. There's a lot of noise. Let's see if you can hear that. Okay, we wanted to show how the agitation pump works, and it's independent. It, it's not going to draw flow off of the main system. Uh, it's using the same battery, but uh, it maintains the same voltage. So we're going to. I'm just going to turn it on now, and you can see that I'm going to scale up that flow rate. I'm going to go to maximum and then I'm going to hit the uh, I'm going to hit the wand and then and see how that has no effect on the, uh, the agitation rate. And you can do that while you're wearing it because the control knob is just right behind your left, the, uh, left strap. Also, even if the level flow, if the fluid level gets low, the intake is down low and it'll it will uh, lift the fluid up and you'll still get pretty good agitation. There's the maximum uh, maximum floor. We're going to dial it up and down. Six gallons an hour. That's quite a bit.